Hello everyone. Today we are looking at our XT9 kilowatt hour meter. I've got an IEM3255 meter. Remember this is uh, a kilowatt hour meter which will work with your external CTs. Um, so we will see how to enter its configuration and change the wiring and the CT ratio. Uh, so first thing I'll do, I'll turn on the power. So you can see there is a status LED which is green. Now it's blinking which indicates it's something wrong. So remember I have uh, I have connected this meter with a single phase supply and when we do the, re uh, the factory reset it goes back to the three phase four wire uh, configuration. So I will show you how to change the wiring first and then we'll see how we change the CT ratio. So the first thing to enter the configuration is to press escape and OK button at the same time. So press and hold. This time it will ask you for a password. For the IEM3255, the password is 0010. Um, so we start from the right hand corner, so it's zero. That's one, okay, zero, zero, and that's it. So access uh, counter. Now it's showing us the wiring. It's asking us if we want to change the wiring. Uh, in this case, we will enter. You'll see it's connected uh, as a three phase four wire system. We'll change that to single phase two wire. Single phase two wire line and neutral. I will press OK. It's asking for wiring of VTs. We haven't got any VTs, so no VTs. Press OK. It's asking for one CT on L1, which is the case when we have single phase supply. So I'll press OK. It will ask to save settings. I will press OK. And after doing that, you can see the status LED is now solid. It's not blinking, which means uh, everything is normal now. Now, the next parameter is the CT ratio. Uh, so remember with the factory reset, uh, factory settings are uh, five by five. So your primary current is five amp and your secondary is five amp as well. Uh, but I've changed it already. Uh, I will show you how to change the CT ratio. Uh, so I will press OK. Now first it shows you CT secondary, it's 5 amp. So this meter, remember, it will always take uh, uh, an input of 5 or 1 amp. So in our case, we'll keep it to 5 amps. Now if your CT, let's say it's 100 to 5 amp. So if your load is 100 amp, you will go with a CT of 100 by 5 amp. So then in that case, your uh, primary current will change to 100. So we'll move, we'll save that. Uh, CT primary is 100 so you can change let's say in your case if it is 200 I will change the value to 200 so that's 100 I'll press the down arrow key so, and it will change to 200 so I press OK OK so that's how you change the wiring and the CT ratio on the XT9 IEM3255 meter. I hope you liked the video. Thanks for watching.